MMTs, we're going to look at the small cap 600. Uh, the bulk of the earnings season for these small cap companies are going to be coming. They're a little different than like the multinationals and large cap. Uh, these are all the names right here that are in the small cap area. This is all the stocks right here. And they're going to report their earnings cycle. So basically what I want to make clear is these stocks have a different way of putting their bottom line numbers and their top line growth and their bottom line growth a little bit different than your bigger cap. So basically all eyes is that we can see that we rallied up to, to the tops from where we had the reversal in the small cap. Small cap led a rally up but then we've had a reversal. We'll come down here to the 440 area and we'll test these weekly moving averages. Uh, the four week bull cycle with a one week reversal uh, cycle is par for the course. Uh, we will say that if we break below uh, these uh, key support level that we had over here because this is where we had that last uh, two week sell off there. Uh, when I take this trend line out of here though, what you're going to be focusing on is how do we bounce in the small cap index when it hits the 10 and 20 week moving averages. Let me caution you something though. Even though that we've had a four week summer rally is that 10 week moving average is still below the 20 week. This trend will not get extremely strong until that 10 week flips up above that 20 week. As far as being in an overbought or oversold area, we're at about 62% at the high here. And the last highs in this percent DS was 78% when we call the major reversal. That was back on 5-1 of 2011. And we cover all of them. Now we're not as overbought, so we'll see how we hit support. Most importantly, though, is within the small cap structure is going to be in this earnings cycle in July as we go through a lot of these small cap stocks and how they deliver their numbers. It's very important. Right now, we'll call for support. At the 10 and 20 week moving average, that's the blue line and the red line. When we come down and we hit that, we'll see how those broader small cap index will bounce. We'll also be looking for some leadership out of there as to what the earning cycles in the small cap versus large cap. Right now, we'll call for support level right here within the bull rally. If we start to sell down through it, because remember, the stocks in the small cap, the leaders are what led the rally up it will be the same leaders and or earnings misses that would lead a rally down in the names that are in the small cap. 